What are channel keywords and how do they work? Now, this is something that many YouTubers are confused about. Now, in this video, I'll be explaining what channel keywords mean and how getting your keywords right will not only make your YouTube channel more visible, but also help you get more views on your YouTube videos. Now, finally, I would also be showing you step by step exactly how to add your keywords to your YouTube channel. Let's get into it. Hello and welcome. My name is Tokwe Aomashi and on this channel, I share information and insights to help you scale your business using YouTube. Now, if you're new here and you want more content like this, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell for notifications. Now to the big question what are youtube channel keywords now youtube channel keywords also known as channel tags are terms or phrases that give youtube an idea of what your channel is all about your channel keywords help youtube understand the type of content you create and who your target audience is if well optimized your channel keywords can also increase your channel's visibility on youtube now, YouTube determines your channel's overall topic and category based on your channel keywords, your channel description, and the types of videos you produce. When you optimize your keywords correctly, this can also improve the rankings of your individual videos on YouTube search. In fact, a study found a small but significant correlation between channel keywords and higher rankings on the YouTube search page. Finally, YouTube uses your channel keywords to determine which videos to promote in the suggested video area. And in this area, you may have noticed YouTube frequently recommends videos from related channels. This is no coincidence. In addition to promoting related videos to the video that you are watching, YouTube also suggests videos from similar channels here. That's why you would occasionally see YouTube suggest a video from a related channel, despite the fact that the topic of the video isn't quite related to the one you're watching. Now let's talk about how to create channel keywords. The first step is to list out potential channel keywords, okay? And this is by coming up with a list of words or phrases that describe your YouTube channel. Now this should be a combination of terms that you are confident describe your channel accurately. Assuming you recently launched a new bridal makeup YouTube channel, you're probably going to be thinking of channel keywords like bridal makeup, wedding makeup, and makeup tutorial. Now, following that, you should include a few popular keywords that people have used to find your content on YouTube. Now, this is for you if your channel is not spanking new. If you've gotten videos in and they've been getting traction, especially from the search page, you want to find the keywords that have been leading people to those videos and also include them in your channel keywords to increase your authority on those keywords. You will find keywords like this in your channel analytics. Now, let me show you. So here is my channel and I'm going to be going straight to my studio. Click on your picture here, YouTube studio. And then go to your analytics. Here you probably want to go with maybe the last one year or lifetime. Let's say the last one year. What has brought you the most traffic? How have people found your content the most? And then you want to go into your reach. And if you scroll down on this page, you will find traffic source, which is YouTube search. Now you want to click on see more to open this up. This is showing you search terms that people have typed in the search bar on YouTube to find your video. Okay. So these are my top search terms, for instance. Now what I would do in my case is to look at my top five keywords here and add them to my channel keywords because I want to increase my authority on this search term. So for instance, the first one is how to transfer YouTube channel to another Google account. This is pretty long. So I may go with the second one, transfer YouTube channel to another Google account, right? And then I also have another good video uh, on how to recover a deleted YouTube channel. I also have a fantastic video around YouTube brand accounts. So I would use these three keywords or keyword phrases in my channel tags as well. 
So for you, because your channel is probably a bridal makeup channel, your top videos are probably videos around Asian bridal makeup or fastest bridal makeup ever. You know, so you want to find those keywords on your channel in your analytics and add them to your channel tags. Ideally, you should use between seven and 10 keywords or between 100 and 150 characters and cover as much of your channel as possible without going too far. If you use too many keywords, they will become diluted. Now, the study I mentioned earlier showed that 100 to 150 characters are the best for channel keywords. And once you get past 150 characters, really, the benefits start to dwindle. Now, let's move to the next step, which is to check out your competitor's channel keywords. Now, if you're stuck or you just want a few keyword ideas, check out the channel keywords that your competitors are using. Now, let's assume this guy is my competitor. This is how to check out his channel keywords. Go to the about section of your competitor's channel. When you get to the about page, right click and on this pop up, click on view page source. You're going to see this very complicated page. It's okay. Don't freak out. What you're going to do now is find keywords in this bunch of codes. Okay. So, and how you do that is by clicking on control F and typing key words. All right. So I have keywords here. Check out the words that come after this highlighted word. You can see here we have online business, side hustle, business ideas, business online, make money online, earn online, you know, how to earn money online, how to make money online, how to earn online, <laughs> how to make money online fast, online money, online earning, side income, online income, make, you know, and then it ends here just before you see owner URL. So you click on this copy and find somewhere to paste these words. These are keywords from your competitor and you can decide to pick some of them as your keywords as well. You can also use Chrome extensions like TubeBuddy or VidIQ to find competitors keywords on YouTube. Now these extensions are useful because they allow you to see channel keywords without having to sift through so many codes like this. And now to your final step, let's go into the actual process of adding these keywords to your YouTube channel. Shall we? All right. I'm going to use this private channel as my case study to show you how to add your keywords to your channel. So in your channel, just click on your channel icon, click on YouTube studio, and in your dashboard, go down to the bottom left here and click on settings on the pop-up, click on channel. And here you will see the space to add your channel keywords. Can you see that? So assuming this is your makeup channel, you want to first start with the general keywords that you compiled before, which is bridal makeup, hit the enter button, type the next one, wedding makeup, right? and so on. And then from your search traffic, those keywords you extracted, remember them, also add them. So for instance, for your channel, this is probably um, fastest bridal makeup ever. That's probably what people typed in the search bar to find your video. And the video is doing very well. You want to dominate that search term even more. So you add it to your channel keywords. And this continues uh, until you are okay with what you have here. Remember, you don't need to maximize the 500 characters here from research. We understand that ideally between a hundred and one fifty works best. Okay. So you don't want to overdo this and then make sure that you also have just between seven to 10 keywords and that should be perfect. Of course, when you're done, you click on save and that is it. Now, if you're a small YouTuber looking for ways to grow your YouTube channel faster, watch this video up here to learn the three things you must consider in order to enjoy a steady inflow of views and subscribers. And hey, I know you are serious about building your YouTube channel. So I have a gift for you in the description area below. It's a free masterclass where I dive deeper into how to get more views more subscribers and make more money on your YouTube channel. Feel free to check it out. 
once again it's absolutely free and it's linked in the description area below so thank you for watching i'll see you in the next video bye